All right, welcome to Pod Fiction. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Another dude of Pod Fitness. It's a dark and stormy night at Professor Stinkbomb's lab, where a machine has been built to save the world from pollution by transexisting it to dimension excrement. Excrement. <laughs> oh fuck. And then something, something, something. Right, blah blah blah. Really gross words. Exactly where the pollution is going. He has a bad feeling. I don't want to read this. Oh, so we're getting closer and closer to Christmas, and there's some presents under the tree that may or may not belong to me. How many presents I got, Brendan? Mm, uh, zero. Wow. Most of them are for children with diseases. Okay. Now I'm trying to learn the controls. So up does nothing. Can you jump, though? Does, like, up, is there a jump button somewhere? Nope. This is... A, B, and C don't jump? A does nothing. B does nothing. C does nothing. Awesome. So we're off to a good well, start. Well, you keep rocking that. Ah. Okay. And still no jump button. Just keep that still on the no there. Button. Nothing. <clears throat> it's weird because I could I could do it earlier when we started the game. Okay, now he's. <laughs> oh, you unplugged the controller. Try the other one. Okay. <sighs> okay. It's uh the button's starting to work now. Yay! And they both and all the sides work. I like that. So this is a game that I bought for Michael. We <clears throat> literally know nothing about it. As you've uh, never heard of this game before. Never. I saw it and I was like, that is the most disgusting '90s ass looking fucking game. No shit, eh? <clears throat> it looks like a mascot waiting to happen. Look at the fucking uh, cape. It's changing colors. It's because you got a power up. Is that what that is? Could be. I don't know. I'm not the game programmer. I'm more of a environment man myself. So I guess I'm in like a fucking stink laboratory. Probably wouldn't know if I read the thing, but... Looks like you're in a I'm land of boogers. boogers. Yeah. Booger land. It's like Captain Underpants a bit. You think like that's the same creators? Like, yeah, boogers, farts, and fucking wieners. This is, there, was, there was a... Oh, hello. Okay, I like that. So, I don't know, this game, I saw it on the shelf, and it was... This is kind of rad. It was kind of like a, I don't really know how much it was, I think it was pretty cheap. I'm like, fuck, this is a pretty cool game for, oh, Pod Ficmus. I'm like, oh, I'm play that game. What I know about this game exceeds it. Are, are you pushing start, or the... Yeah, first of this, because when you release it, it gets a fart. That's kind of cool. But it, like, pauses the game, too. The graphics are kind of cool, I don't hate that. Yeah, not too bad. Could be worse, it could be, uh, Jurassic Park. That was a fucking piece of shit. This game is actually like playable, which is cool. It looks kind of neat too. I mean, as far as Sega games go, honestly, everything in this generation of games kind of sucked ass. Yeah, no shit. Or no snot. Ha ha ha. Anywho. Oh, this is, it's a oh, nose tube. Up a nose. I don't hate that. Can you I, grab this controller? Yeah, I'll take it out of your hands completely, Garçon. Right. Give me the best hypothetical you can think of at the moment. Um, okay. There's a, there's a pill on the table. Boom, pills. <laughs> Love me some pills. Uh, there is a 80% chance you take that pill, you end up in this world right now. Ooh, 80%? 80% chance. Okay. The other 20% is you end up in gumball land. And you get to you get to live in a gumball land, everything's all happy, and everything's nice and cheery and fun. Okay. You there is a walk away option. The walkaway option is that you have to go to a shittier version of Earth, where everyone farts all the time. That's just Earth. But like, it's they like more often. They fart a lot. Um, I'll take this Earth with more farts. Really? You're just gonna walk away? I don't know that other, those other Earths. This place huh? isn't that bad. Like, dude, do you remember the conversation we had about if everybody dies? I'm probably going to kill myself in like a post-apocalypse. Yes. I'm going to a world where I don't know anybody. What okay. do you think going to happen? Checks out. Was that just a bonus level that you were in? I think so. Okay. I like how fucking smug these guys are too. Like, mm -hmm. I've asked this question a lot on the show. Would you rather have uh, dicks for fingers or knives for fingers? Uh, I remember your old answer. We'll see if the answer has changed since. I'm going to go with knives. Your answer has not changed. You're a knife man. I'm a knife man. Knife's, Galaga. Knife's chow. Playing Galaga. <laughs> wow. You skitty beep pop it up poop. I'm digging holes with my big old poop. I like climbing branches to Satan's laboratory. Fuck. Matt, what do the plungers do? Do you know what the plungers do? 
We also have like a snot meter up here and a burp meter up there. I don't know if you've been using those. Do they do I'm anything? To see if Is there a way to like buttons do anything? There's definitely a burp option. Yeah, but it pauses the game. Does th yeah? Do the other gray buttons do anything? I just melted away. That was actually kind of cool. I missed it. <laughs> Flatulent swamps. Do 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 poop. Give me the best poop joke you have. Um. How many times do you uh, shit yourself in a year? Shit myself? Yeah, in Zero. a year. Zero. Weird. Very common tongue around these parts. Exactly. At least it's... It, it usually it's... Oh, I'm flinging boogers by tapping uh, double A. There you go. Does your booger meter go... Fling it again? Uh, oh, I should probably mention... Oh, wow. You died really quick. Yeah. That was dumb. Man, I got burpees. Burpee boy? I'm doing burpees with my papa. He's <laughs> getting that breath tag. Me. What are you most excited for this year for Christmas? Because it's a Christmas time, boy. It's Christmas time. I'm excited for gifts. Yeah, what kind of gifts are you getting? I don't know. I don't know what my buddy's getting. It better be something expensive and cool and, like, maybe a puppy. If it's not a puppy, then we're probably not going to be friends. I, I don't want to say that, but, yeah, it's probably true. Because I got you, like, a puppy. What kind of puppy would you want if you get a puppy? Probably Golden Retriever. Aw, oh, fucking be original, Michael. Um, Rottweiler. Rottweiler. Good enough? No. Oh. Um, Are you good? Jesus Christ. I thought you were fucking actually, like, needing assistance over there. <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> I'm just talking to Michael directly. <laughs> yeah, nobody else <laughs> Nobody else. Room. What the fuck is wrong with you? Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Who the fuck are you? I locked Bob Dylan up on stage. Uh, Dalmatian would be kind of cool. Dalmatians are cool. I like Dalmatians. Ooh. Did I ever tell you the time that we convinced Brooke that Dalmatians were extinct? Nope. Yeah, Alicia and I one time convinced uh, Brooke that Dalmatians were extinct. Mm -hmm. After the movies, everyone bought them, but then they bought them so much that they had, like, deformities and just died real fast. Wow. And uh, then one day, like, several years later, we saw a Dalmatian. She's like, the last Dalmatian! She was, like, a kid. No she, like, runs up. She, like, runs up to it. She's like, a Dalmatian! It's really funny. That's actually crazy. Uh, people just believe Is that, that when you told her that it was bullshit, or you just... I don't even think we actually told her. I think she just learned in life. We may have told her, or laughed a bunch. I don't remember. I think we told her. I think we that's, told her. That's really, really mean. It's really easy to convince anyone of anything, really. They're just want to believe whatever. Because things in life are fucking weird. I was actually watching True. someone talk about uh, seahorses and, like, how stupid the fact that a seahorse exists oh. is. Like, just how dumb... Its existence in general Yeah, is. like, it just, like, it's a really stupid creature. Like, it shouldn't exist. Try doing the double A thing. Can you play both? I did it. It's not working. Oh, that's it. Hello? <laughs> He's very upset. Hello? Is it me you're throwing boogers at? <laughs> I can see it in your eyes. I can see it in your nose. <laughs> Yo, real gross. <laughs> if, a, if a person made a song about you, and it was like, about one of your bad qualities, like it was like a really mean song. I'd be very upset. What do you think would be like the worst? Like what would the song be about? It's about like one of your worst qualities as a human. I think that's the exit, not the, not you can't go in. The other one had a down arrow on it. I know. Um, Jesus fucking Christ, Michael, put me on blast over here. It's probably my, like, I sometimes will complete a sentence that someone's saying before they uh, actually get there. Fucking melty, man. You can take over for a little bit. Okay. Oh, hand it to me when, I get a game, when you get a game over. That's nice. You're welcome. Can I actually, like, do some... Oh, this is your password. Scary is monster coming at you. Hello? We got a big old person, and he's got two shoes. I'm just gonna go right to pass, I guess? I don't know. Let's start. We'll just start from, from scratchies. Scratch it. Can I go? Okay, let's go push down. Uh, it's probably a song about how I interrupt people when they're telling sentences sometimes because I know the answer to what they're going to say before they say it. What about how grumpy you get when people uh, cut you off? I don't think I like. I don't think that's my worst what? feature. I know you're doing it on purpose. What? It's not... Doing what on purpose? What is this? Jesus Christ! I did not see. Did that say sex? No. <laughs> I wish it did. <laughs> yes, please. Sign me up for another. What do the plungers do? Okay. What does the cape do? What's the most inappropriate kid movie you ever watched? Oh, you asked me this before. No way, I did not ask you this yeah, before. Yeah, well, the question was more specifically, what was the movie that you watched as a kid that you just didn't get until you were okay. older? That makes sense. Uh, but inappropriate kid movie? I don't know. Shrek was pretty inappropriate. Shrek was, it had some fucked up on it. There was lots of, uh, lots of dirty jokes in it. Okay, hello. You just gotta swing. Just let it swing, don't jump. I missed a little bit back there. I'm gonna see if I can just, like, speed run this. Oh, the, the color of your cape indicates how much health you have left. Oh, weird. 
Well, I don't know. I just got hit and it flashed, so I'm guessing that's what's got oh. me. Oh, okay. Put up a booger, man. Okay, and I'm not, I don't want to do the bonus. I'm just going to scooch right past it. If you... How about... So... Yeah, Shrek, you, I really talked about, like, ass and stuff in Shrek. I was like, oh, that's pretty risque. Give me that badonka donk Yeah, like that. Buckle up, or, I don't know. There's a lot of weird, like, jokes in Shrek that, like, only adults would get. Yeah, definitely. Also, he rips a page out of a book and wipes his ass, so that's pretty fucked that's up. That's true. And then, and then, uh... Yeah, poop, poop, joke. Fucking, and then Smash Mouth plays. And that's just fucking inappropriate for all ages. <laughs> you know what's funny? Like, back then, like, everyone loved Smash Mouth. Like, that song was huge. Oh. If you ask your parents, like, anyone who was, like, well, even, like... I, my parents would be like, who's Smash Mouth? Because... Hello? Uh... I just think, like, see, now my cape is yellow, so I got, like, one hit left. Um, but, like, back then, like, like everyone's like, oh, I love that song. Yeah, the world wins to... They became a meme, and then everyone's like, oh, that song's fucking stupid. It's like, you fucking jammed to it. Don't lie. Don't lie, you prick. You loved the Shrek movie and the Digimon movie. Everybody liked the Shrek movie. The movie sucked, though. Shrek? Yeah, it sucks. I think it's kind of funny. Unless it's, like, you're with a kid, Hello? and there's nothing else to watch. Brr. And then you're all melty. Like, if there's nothing else to watch, and it's like, hey, either Paw Patrol or Shrek, I'm gonna pick fucking Shrek, but... I, how many times do you pick Shrek though before you start watching Paw Patrol? Every time. Every time? I've never actually watched Paw Patrol on the kind of fact that I don't have kids. It's like really, it's like a really young kid show. Is it's it like... Little puppies that like, rescue other puppies. Are you fucking high? That's bullshit. That was one hit! That was one hit wonder, bro. Fuck off! Dude, That's you're one... basically Smash Mouth. Aww, oh, they were not... Uh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Remember that time someone threw bread on stage at them? No. You never heard about that? No. Did they get upset? Yeah, they got upset. It was really funny. Someone threw bread on stage at them. <laughs> who the fuck does that? Who brings bread to a concert? <laughs> you know what's funny? Like, pr the person who's, like, probably, like, security check, like, are you fucking kidding me? Ah, uh, some. Oh. person who's, like, security checks, like, a loaf of bread, kind of weird, but come on in, I guess. Yeah, oh, yeah. I'll try and speed run that again. I guess you was... make some toast or something. I guess, yeah, what is there, a toaster on site? Like, mm -hmm. no. Every Smash Mouth concert has at least five toasters. Hold on, I'm gonna put in a password for the last level. Alright, in terms of fucking Shrek movies, how many have you seen? All of them. Have you actually? Have yeah, you actually? I've seen one, Have two, you seen three. Shrek the Hull? Yes, I have. No, you have not. Yes, I have. Shut the, what happens? Um, sorry, Shrek. No, no, I didn't see Shrek the Hull. I saw it's Shrek Forever After. That's what I was thinking of. What the fuck is... Sh I know, I've seen one, two, and three. What's Forever After? Forever After is like one where... There's like a life where Fiona doesn't know who he is and he doesn't have kids and all this stuff like that. Who the fuck does Shrek get kids? He gets them in like the fucking like last movie. Does he have kids in Shrek 2? Yeah. <laughs> Something like that. I don't fucking Obviously know. the biggest Shrek enthusiast in the room over here <laughs> fucking seen yeah, him. Yeah, 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 yeah. He just has so much arcane knowledge he just like, you know. Is it weird that we're talking about Shrek because everything in this game looks like Shrek? <laughs> everything in this game is a Shrek. <laughs> You're dead. You're so dead. Have you ever died? What do you think death's like? <laughs> think it's like a cat in a bag and then you smash that bag? Is that dead? What would, would you... I, I, I probably should, I'm pretty sure I told you this story before. So what would you do if you walk in into a bedroom, you're babysitting a kid and you walk in the bedroom and this kid's putting little little kittens into a baggie? What would you do? Beat the shit out of the little kid. That's what I did. <laughs> I was gonna say said, but I all actually, right, and that's the that's how Brennan went to jail. <laughs> no, I, I caught I caught this kid once. I was babysitting this this kid, and he had like a cat because his family was all ghetto and shit. And he had this cat, and they had kittens, and they were putting like little kittens inside of the, like the kid was putting kittens inside the baggies, and it like he wasn't like doing it like maliciously. I just don't think he honestly knew. And it was funny because the kittens like were like letting him do it, because <laughs> they're kittens. Little kittens, yeah, they don't, they don't know any better, so they're just like, oh, this is comfy. So they just go in the baggie, and they weren't even fighting. And I was like, they're gonna die. <laughs> you can't put kittens in baggies. Why? Are you kidding me? <laughs> so what'd you do? I I gave him a little push. <laughs> I mean, like, I was. What the fuck you doing? I was 25, and he was, you know, just, 18. <laughs> so maybe he did know the difference. Maybe. Wow. Okay. Can Do you we... think if you had a little brother, you'd be a piece of shit to him? Uh, probably not. I might even be. Di I might even become. Oh shit! Hello. Now you're kind of a piece of shit to me. <laughs> yeah, but you're. You'd definitely be a piece of. You'd be. You'd torture that kid so much. Yeah, probably. Yeah, you'd be like, oh, he still doesn't believe in Dalmatians. 
Fucking idiot. Fucking retard. Yep. Okay. Every time, like, we're, we're, nah, we're going to put a retard counter in every episode. Every time you say retard in an episode, it's going to be really I'm gonna get, The thing is, that, that'll uh, encourage me to stop saying that. That's a lie. <laughs> the only thing that will stop encouraging you from saying it is if we uh, just actively embrace it, you know? I actually just got further than I've ever got, so I'm really proud of myself right now. Good for you. I would kind of like to see a different level, if I'm being all. If I'm being all honest. Oh shit, I beat the level. Oh, uh, we won a level. No, no, it's okay. Good. All right. Let's cut it there. Yep. All right. Well, have yourselves a great day. Pod fake miss. We're probably never going to play this game again. If you want it. Thanks for being my friend. Fuck you. Everybody. I just want to say to future Michael, if you're listening to this right now, um, trash needs to be taken out. See you.